shoulder press, shoulder presses with the barbell. And <clears throat> right in the beginning, I started to go down quite a bit. Uh, my elbows were going down quite a bit. But um, this was putting some un wanted pressure on my elbows I think and in my elbows I could feel some little bit of pain in my elbows and I didn't like I don't I don't like any pain in the elbows so what I'm starting to do after I do each set then I go well I'm gonna bring that barbell down to just my eye to just my eye level you know uh, I'm not gonna bring it all the way down to my shoulders um, it's better if you bring it down just to your eye because then you don't put so much pressure on your shoulders. I, I mean, uh, on your elbows. And, and another thing that I did after a little bit of time was I started to space my hands out. I started to move my hands further and further towards the, uh, plates or the weight plates or the, the, the uh, um, the, the plates. You see... You see, my hand is really close to the plates right there on this exercise, and and this was the last one of the last sets, and and I think a lot it's a lot better if I get my hands closer to the plates, uh, and it's also what I wanted to do was I wanted to do front presses, uh, just to work on that, and I wanted to do back presses. Uh, for some reason, I'm a little bit stronger with the back with doing the barbell presses behind the back but behind the head than I am with doing the barbell presses in the front you know um, so uh, doing it in the back I don't know if it, it uses different muscles I think than it does if you put the barbell in the front and either way it's a good shoulder exercise I I talked to um, uh, Baz blog and he was saying that this that the the uh, shoulder press is a really good shoulder exercise for people in wheelchairs it just keeps tries to keep maintain your shoulder strength